Well, hello guys, I would like to show you the easiest and fastest way to create your own blueprints for your everyday KSP needs. Um, basically you will only need two things. Um, the first one is of course the uh, Chrono Vessel Viewer mod, which runs on the 1.9 version of the game for sure. And the second one is a photo editing software, basically uh, any kind uh, would be just fine, but I don't use Photoshop and uh, GIMP, basically because... It ain't familiar. I think we should at least try, boss. I said it ain't familiar! Yeah, so uh, I use Photoscape X because it uh, just fits for my needs and even the free version of the software is uh, more than enough to to create those uh, blueprints. So without further ado, let's see what you should do. So after you took the raw image, you have to cut out the background like this. Uh, and then you, uh, you have to save it in a format of PNG and that's uh, important because uh, uh, only this way the uh, background will be transparent and um, that's important so after the, after you cut out the background you have to make the whole picture grayscaled like this and uh, you have to use the edge effect to bring out the edges of the picture so only the outer lines of your craft will be visible you you have to save it once again and we are going back to cut out the outside and right now together with the inside like this and that's right now just just fine. You have to save it once again. Yes, I would like to overwrite. So, because because the the raw picture uh, is not uh, beautiful enough, uh, I use the negative effect to to make it much more smoother. I make it much more brighter and uh, pull up the dark uh, effects too. The auto contrast will be on, on high and the auto levels too, basically. Yeah, and that's what we need. Uh, and let's do the final save. And basically uh, what you need is a background, which you can find on the internet. And then uh, you have to uh, import your uh, new um, blueprint picture. And basically here you are. Yeah, I know that's uh, not very beautiful because you have to uh, blend it with the background. Uh, you can use even uh, the the screen uh, mode or the linear dodge. So you can, yeah. Here is your your uh, perfect perfect uh, blue blueprint of your of your craft. Yeah, uh, but uh, that's work with the with the uh, exploded um, picture or yeah as as well. And right now I show it to you as well. You basically have to do the same. So uh, you you have to delete the background and once again save it, make it grayscale, uh, apply the uh, edge effect, once again uh, have to delete the, the uh, inside and the outside as well, and 
basically that's all yeah, I don't, yeah. so make it grayscale once again apply the edge effect make it 100% make it pretty save it once again yay uh, so that's why I said that it's uh, quite simple and, and easy yeah and uh, with this um, picture we will do the same as as with the base so we will put in a negative and and uh, we will make it much more prettier with uh, those effects so let's do the negative auto contrast on high auto level on high make it brighter make the dark things auto contrast maybe on the auto level maybe it mm -hmm. yeah yeah basically that's it and uh, yeah once again what you will need is a background and that's all and here you are and your very first blueprint is done and you have to uh, blend it with uh, the background once again to make it prettier so here you are beautiful so I I hope you you like this uh, short and uh, hopefully interesting tutorial and with uh, this um, method for example I made my uh, my uh, own blueprint design for my uh, hanging base just a minute so here you are <laughs> yeah I hope you like it and uh, write in the comments please so did you like it or not or what's your opinion and see you next time